Hello and welcome back to Let's Play Aladdin for the Genesis, with your host as always, Mitch Rybrand. Yeah! Right now we are in the palace. Look at that! Oh, that's cute. It's a good movie. I like this movie. And the game, too. But mostly the movie. That movie was awesome. Mostly for the music. Oh my god, speaking of music, this music is awesome! Oh yeah, this is one of those stages where apples are really useful. I believe this is the second or third last stage, so it starts to get, uh, difficult. Kind of unfair difficulty, if you ask me, with these fish. No. That. Nah. Die. Always constantly swing your sword when you're on a magic carpet ride. Because it'll lead you into all kinds of enemies if you don't. And look up for spikes. Apparently the palace is just covered in spikes. It's really hard to get around the palace too, because apparently you have to use, like, rope jumps and crap. Hmm. Is this a rope I can climb? Oh, I can go out here. <laughs> Stupid. Just keep on swinging. If you're wondering how to get some of those apples and everything that you can't quite reach, you're supposed to jump off during the ride to get to them. Personally, I say it's not worth it. Yeah, some of these enemies are pretty easy if you have a good, uh, distance. Stab him in the groin. Ah, die, Iago. Die, other Iago. Where's that health? I want the health. Yes. Oh god, there's an army of Iagos. I think that's cheating, guys. He's got more than one Iago. You could just say he's a bunch of parrots, but no, they're quite clearly Iago. Oh, that was mean, game. That was mean. Did you see that? He hit me and I just fell off the platform. Now I'm almost dead. I'm two hits from death. That was mean, game. That was a mean trick. Okay, can the, car can the carpet just take me up? I just want to go up. And I hate how Iago respawns. Can... There. Thanks, game. Thanks. Do I want the help? Why the hell not? Watch, I'll just lose it to Iago. Die, Iago! Die, Iago. I think those were the only two Iagos that can hit me. I think he's the only enemy that respawns, too. Up. Go up, carpet. Up. It's not that hard. Up. Thank you. Oh! I wasn't even touching a button. That was mean. Who playtested that? Oh, and I got hit! Well, there goes the whole point of jumping off of the thing. Actually, I think I might have one more hit worth. Come on. I'm tempted to hold down the uh, fast-forward button right now. I'm sorely tempted. There, I jumped off early. I don't trust your stupid carpet. Here's Iago come to fuck it all up. Iago, the shit wrecker. See, Dave the tree, he's the cool collected one. Iago, he'll just mess you up. Abu! Ugh. How do I free you? Mmm. There we go. Don't know if that does anything. I think it does. Hey, you! I want one-ups. Get with it! It's just head bang. Bang your head! I almost said rock your head, because I haven't listened to that song in forever and I'm dumb. 
Uh, I believe that pit is where I have to go, and it takes me directly into Spikes. No, it takes me directly around Spikes, which is nice. Eh. Eh. Oh god, I remember this boss battle. Yago, come to mess me up again. I like the music they give for this. Like, this is supposed to be some kind of epic battle scene. It's actually quite easy once you start to get in the groove of it. I mean, you can't use your sword, but that cog hurts you. If you just get the right angle, this is what I always did as a kid, you just get the right angle and you basically won unless you run out of apples. Then you have to run around and get the apples that spawn. Which I think is gonna happen. No, I killed him! So how many times- can someone count how many Iagos I killed this stage? Because I can't be asked to. Just, okay, I've got like four of these things, it's gonna be Jafar. Lucky. Lucky. Really lucky. Oh, wow. So I would have rather one ups. That's all I buy, anyways. Oh. It skipped the cutscene. That's weird. I didn't click on anything. Okay. Jafar's Palace! No, oh, yeah, this is the last level of the game. We're here already, folks. So uh, until next time, have a nice day!